Good morning, welcome to Lena. Today I'm doing a slip through of the Harcourt Saints. This is the grade 5 version. You know by the little notches on the side, what version you have. Um, they do have different covers depending on what publication year you would pick. Um, but this one is obviously a lion. So, in terms of what we have inside, it gives you some information about mountain lions, which is cute because obviously that's the cover. So, we have the 2009 version here. So in terms of what's inside, we've got a whole section for getting ready for science. Just ignore that noise, I'm having floor laid in my living room, so uh, I thought I'd take this opportunity to film this video, but maybe it wasn't such a great idea. But anyway, we've got life science. We have got, this is interactions among living things, so it's still part of life science. Earth science. Physical science. Okay, and the actual topic. So, as part of the life science, we've got cells to body systems, we've got classifying living things, plant growth and reproduction, animal growth and hereditary, and then we've got energy and ecosystems, ecosystems and change. In the earth science, we've got the rock cycle, fossils, changes to earth's surface using the resources. Got weather and the water cycle, Earth's oceans, Earth, Moon, and beyond. And physical science, we've got properties of matter, electricity, energy, sound and light, forces, motion. And it's set up, as you can see, with the chapter, lessons, and then a chapter review and test preparation. And it appears it's the same. I'm looking at this for the first time with you. It appears it's the same for each, pretty much although there are some visual summaries. Okay, so let's have a look at what it looks like for the first chapter. Now, I think this is just an introduction, so it's all about getting ready for science. So they have the big idea here with a couple of lessons in. So it gives us our big idea. To plan and carry out an experiment, scientists observe and ask questions. We've got our essential questions, lesson one, two, and three. So scientific method, inquiry skills, do scientists use and what tools? It gives you some information here. And then we've got our fast fact, investigate, read and learn, what tools do scientists use, talks about a microscope and a balance in this case, measuring, drawing conclusions, independent inquiry, make an observation chart, and we've got using tools, it shows you all the different tools and explains about them a bit, we have a little section on microscopes with some questions, main idea and details, temperature, We've got a little insta lab here so you can do a little mini experiment, safety in the lab, lesson review, so you main idea and details, vocabulary, critical thinking, then they always make connections so we've got a writing option, a maths option and a health option, so it's cross curricular in that respect. There's the inquiry section for the lesson two. Design an airplane. This is just in the first section, the introduction. We've got another Insta Lab vocabulary. I'm making connections again. And then the scientific method. So our vocab here is scientific method, hypothesis, and evidence. Plan and conduct an investigation conclusions our connections again and then we have review and test prep and then safety in science and then we get into our first um, subject specific so it's life science so we've got science on location and projects for home or school so these are our little topics humpback whale national marine sanctuary the hidden zoo leaping lemurs survey of plants and animals our chapters and then unit B as well. It has like a different material, some more card type for the different sections. Okay, so we've got the Hawaiian Islands with a little passage for them to read about the whales. I think in right section. Then we've got the science and location article for the hidden zoo. And then again, there's some questions there for them, and then the leaping lemurs article. 
Okay, here's our project, a survey of plants and animals, and then a design your own investigation section. And then we're on process of living things. So cells, the body system, so you've got your big idea, your lesson over here. I love the, um, the photos in here. There's a picture of some cells for them to look at. We've got their vocabulary here. Observing cells, so here you do a little experiment with onion, with an onion onto the microscope. We've got another insta lab where they can make a cell model. Comparing plant and animal cells. Essential questions, and then they've got um, a writing, a math, and a language arts connection, as well as their main idea. Uh, summarise and draw conclusions what they've done, been doing, the vocabulary, the test prep, and then lesson two. The digestive system, make a model for the Insta Lab. Connections again. Hear all the voices in the background, it's the workmen doing math rule. <laughs> okay, and then we've got a weekly reader section. So, this is Stephanie's favorite foods where she's talking about um, different types of food that she likes and what happens to your body when you eat them. It looks like now we've got review and test prep. This is the living things section. Classifying shoes. Grouping living things. Our insta lab. Making connections. Build a model backbone. Another insta lab. So I really like all the little different experiments that they have to go with each each chapter. So I haven't decided yet whether this will be our main science curriculum or whether we'll use it as a supplement. Um, I'm still in the process of purchasing my curriculum. I really wanted to get my hands on this though and have a look at what it was like inside and I am really impressed with it. So it's definitely a strong contender. Um, but as I said, I don't know if I want it to be, there's your weekly reader, our main curriculum or as in a, a supplement. Um, I'm going still in the process of deciding what I'd like to do, but I am really impressed with it. I think it's fantastic. Um, there's the cell reproduction. Just showing you all the biology ones. So let's have a look at a different science type of science so you can compare. So there's a learned and inherited behaviour investigation. That would be a really fun one. Model a beak for the Insta Lab. And I do really like these extra cross-curricular activities because you can link it with language arts, maths and science as well. Uh, well, in that case, language arts. <laughs> so we look at some people in science, think and write, review and test prep. So that's just, there's the visual summary. That's what that looks like. Another inquiry investigation experiment using carbon dioxide guided inquiry. Photosynthesis. Read and learn. Oh, the 
this is really good. I'm really impressed with it. As I said, this is the first time I'm seeing it with you. So we've got a food pyramid here. And there's our weekly reader. Review and test prep. Another experiment to do. Insta Labs. I really like those as well. There's an awful lot I actually really do like about this. <laughs> Serving effects of fertilizer. And mounting a sculpture for the InstaLab. Talking about batteries and pollution there. It's a good one. And then we've got our people in science again. I really like this aspect as well. So this is a career, a career ecologist that they're showing you information about. Okay, so let's have a look at the earth science. Again, it's more thick cardboard. So we've got Craters of Diamond State Park. So this is our for our signs on location. I really like that aspect too. A crystal cave. And then Georgia Marble. And then we've got a project for home or school. It's all that sandstone. Okay. So processes that change earth. So the rock cycle. What are minerals? The vocabulary over here. Mineral properties, uh, ex guided experiment. All the different types of minerals. Yeah. Okay, identifying rock. In review, and we've got our um, different connections. I think that should say language arts. <laughs> um, how are rocks changing? So we've got our molding rocks here, the rock cycle, a little insta lab again. Uh, writing, they actually put writing correctly this time, <laughs> math and social studies, our people in science, review and test prep, and the fossils, and then there is a guide inquiry again um, to make a layer cup, so that'll be really fun, I like that idea. Now, the more I'm going through it, the more I'm really, li <laughs> really liking it. And uh, InstaLab make a mold fossil model. How are fossils like today's living things? Classifying fossils. Finds up close. Again, InstaLab. Attack a guineazilla for our weekly reader. That's a funny one. She'll like that. Review and test prep. Landforms again, making a model. And then we've got our little investigation experiment over there. The thing that I really like about it as well is that it's different um, specialities of science. It's not just one whole topic throughout the whole year. I really like the different units. weekly topic A little filtering water experiment growing plants more 
water. Recycling. And then we've got our people in science. So it is a, uh, obviously a textbook, but I think there's a lot to it. It's you know it's not just a boring um, read. You know there's lots of amazing pictures. There's lo different little activities to keep them interested throughout. Um, little case studies, little uh, things for them to read about different scientists. So I really like the mixture. And I do like the cross-curricular activities as well, should you want to do those and expand making raindrops. So, you know, you could add, add those into your planning for that week. So, definitely a top contender um, to do for our science this year, but Obviously, you'll find out for sure what I decide once I share my curriculum for the year, which I believe will be in June. We're in the ocean now. <laughs> Don't drink the water. That's interesting. Making waves. on you know that's fun effects of waves on a beach then we've got our scientists test prep and review and then earth moon and beyond I think this will be the last one I show you I'll just have a quick look in the back to see if there's anything in addition, talking about time zones, doing Insta Lab, making connections. That makes up our solar system. Make a telescope for their experiment. Writing math and literature. So I read about some of her poetry. That's really good, I like that. And then our weekly reader is Beyond the Shuttle. Visual summary, and then we move on to our next topic, which is physical science. We're just gonna have a quick look in the back. So we've got our index, glossary. everything so that's what it looks like that's the flip through of the rest of it but i showed you pretty much most of everything in there so that's hot court science grade five if you've got any questions let me know otherwise i'll see you in the next video take care bye for now